Hey everyone, welcome back, or welcome for the first time to our 7 Days to Die Let's Play, Better Left Dead. Starting off Season 2 at the uh, tail end of the Day 35 Horde, we're in the morning of Day 36. Uh, we do have a little bit of damage it looks like to take care of, so we'll probably uh, just catalog what we need to do out of that, and then uh, maybe do some quests and whatnot. We definitely need to refill our ammo, because we unfortunately spent way too much defending against that uh, horde last night on day 35. But, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do to survive. So, let's see here. Got a decent amount of crafting supplies. I think we'll be fine there. Well, I went ahead and uh, cataloged everything. Ultimately, uh, I think we're going to go ahead and just repair stuff on a different day. Nothing is really in an emergency repair state. It's just little chips of damage here and there. So, let's see if we can't get a quick and easy quest. A buried quest should be pretty easy. We'll just uh, go ahead and see you there. And here we are, about to take care of this stupid quest. We'll go ahead and start digging and just kind of cut in between the zombies here because uh, you know watching me dig ain't exactly the most exciting thing but killing zombies can be so we'll get started here now that we've got our heading set and we got a wave of zombies that came spawning in I think we'll go ahead and just I know I said we were trying to save our ammo and whatnot but screw it uh, see a zombie running at you you just want to take care of them with the shotgun Alright, make sure I'm fully reloaded on everything in case I get jumped again. Well, when I get jumped again. I, it's probably a guarantee I'll get at least one more. And here's the second wave. Go ahead and bash them in with the club. Ain't nothing too pressing or dangerous about them. And then just get back to freaking digging. Uh, this thing's been in a pain in the ass. I've been doing it for over an hour in game. It's like 15 minutes IRL. Oh shit. Okay. Nope. I'm just gonna go ahead and shoot all of them. Oh fuck. Fuck. Okay, yeah, so they're dead. Get up. Can I get up? Come on. Fuck. Fuck it. Just kill him. And then get up top here. Yeah. Took care of him. Ugh, this damn thing's taking way too freaking long to find. It's really annoying. Oh, of course. So I was waiting for that one straggler to come from that last wave from the freaking buried. We got a giant, well, not giant, but a little mini horde coming in. Thankfully, shotgun seem to be doing some work getting the two for ones. See if I can't do it again. Ooh, pretty close there. Ah, damn. He ended up surviving. Well, let's see what we got here, though. Okay, well, you know, kind of break even. I think I've spent roughly about 12 shotgun shells since I've been here. Can't go too much farther. I'm going to lose the quest. Oh, thank God. Turn around. I have seriously been here for over two hours in game now. It's ridiculous. Just never, never had such a hard fucking dig quest to go through before in the buried treasure. And finally found it. Went through all of that for that. That is fucking disappointing. Uh, I guess we could just get on the mini bike and run, but might as well get some XP while we're here. Definitely have some priority targets over here, though. Should have probably waited for them to get a little bit closer to have more effective shotgun bursts, but I don't really want to be juggling distances with those two types fighting me right now. Come on. Yep, so he did finally track that biker back there. You in. There we go. Man, I really can't wait to get the better shotgun. But go ahead and check back in at Joel, see what he's got here. Um, I'm 
thinking recog is gonna be what we want here but that steel sledgehammer might be good too um, what is that damage against my club I guess the club would be better because I do have all of my perks and stuff for that right now but I mean I could also just respect but we're just gonna go with the recog for now um, I think we're going to do a couple more buried. I think I saw a tier 2 buried and a tier 1 buried. No, just a tier 1 buried. We'll just go ahead and do those off camera. Um, as we were coming back from the tier 1 buried supplies, supply drop finally came. Figured, what the hell? Free stuff is free stuff. Come on. Try and park this someplace. It's not going to go flying off, so I have to chase after it. You know what, screw it, just park it right here, get off. Oh, <laughs> we actually uh, have been here before. That's kind of funny. Did a uh, quest like uh, in season one, like episode nine or something. Ooh, baby, that is what I wanted. You can always use more turrets. You can have like two of those, I think, if you, two or three, if you spec all the way into the turrets, which uh, I will gladly do eventually. I do have a lot of intellect points going on right now because I still need my vehicles. A little ridiculous that I'm like what, uh, 30, almost 37 days, uh, 36 days, 37 days. Still no motorcycle, still rocking the mini bike. But uh, we'll go ahead and get back to Joel, see what he's got. We need to uh, kind of update our base some more in between the repairs I wasn't too impressed with uh, the little additions that we made I do think those wouldn't be a bad purchase but then again I do have the headlamp and I have the nerd goggles right now and I kind of like that 10% experience buff uh, we don't really need an engine right now Hopefully they'll have something uh, really cool. Well, I was going to say in the book section, but all they've got is armor. And even though I've got tier 5 steel armor, I mean, I guess I'll buy these. And if anybody ever joins, I'll be able to hopefully uh, eventually make them some steel armor. Uh, what do we got? What do we got? This is going to restock tomorrow. Ooh, we got a lot of electrical components. We are probably going to take those because I don't have a bank. I'm pretty sure you need cells. I don't know if this will generate power by itself without the cells. If it doesn't, that will suck. If not, or, uh, you know, that definitely would suck if it doesn't, but. We'll just have to find whatever gets it to make it and we'll hook our lights up to that and then we only have to keep a generator filled for our defenses not our defenses and our lights uh, definitely need that I don't have enough money for that right now I guess let's see if we can't do a quest real quick for him uh, what's like the closest tier to Okay, yep, 1.1 kilometers and just a straight kill clear quest. So, going ahead to get those started. I already looted the uh, mailboxes, went ahead and looted them again. Didn't really find anything super interesting, but we're just going to power through this real quick and get it done real quick so we can get back to Joel before he closes. Haste makes waste, but we don't really need anything as far as drops in here. And, uh,. The zombie shouldn't pose too much of a threat. Excuse me, I'm getting me over a uh, cold there and I had to uh, kind of wet my throat again since it's been a little sore. Pretty much blew through all those. We'll just loot these off camera. I think I'm going to get a bunch of beer out of them or at least water. And take care of her. So I think we just have that other building and we're just, we're already done barely been here about 10 minutes 15 minutes 
What do we got here? Nothing good. And... Okay, I'll take that, but otherwise, also nothing really good. And... He's dead, you're dead. Okay, I think we just have to do the ones upstairs. Nope, okay, so there was one still in the closet. Let's see if what's in this little cache here. Dog do. I don't need those anymore right now. Ooh, yeah, two for one. And, and you still need that. Still can only make... Uh, the stupid cement mixers. I can't make chemistry sets yet, even though I already have one from a quest I got. Oh, we're gonna do a little bit of inventory Tetris and get all this organized. Should have probably dropped off all that electrical stuff I bought from Joel before I left, but hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, okay, gotta play more inventory Tetris, unfortunately, but. I'll do that off screen. I think we're going to go ahead and load up these pants though with some mods that we don't want and uh, then pop a uh, sugar bits and sell those off in a big spree. We also need to uh, farm up a bunch of stone. So, ooh, I will, the ammo, mm, I can make ammo but I can't make steel so I got to take the steel right now. And we'll take another quest I guess to overnight. Rise Realty. I've been there before. What else do we got in here? Get that generator bank. We can drop all these off and then we'll uh, go ahead and head to the quest here. Do that overnight. Come back and see what else we can get up to. Alright, here we are. Take care of this dumbass real quick. Get it started. Come on. There we go. Mm, nothing too pressing. Oh, hello. It's a big fat bitch. Big fat bitch down. Go ahead and close the door, even though there's a giant hole there. Maybe they'll be stupid and try to go through that. And, oh, fucking vulture. Boom! Sent that whore home in a taxa! <laughs> Good old Buck Strickland. For you King of the Hill fans out there. Oh boy, a newsy hat. That's always what I wanted. Ooh, that was brutal. I mean, I don't use spears, but whatever. Um, let's see. Oh. Yeah, lit them on fire. I wonder if that should hurt, like, radiated zombies more, because, like... You know, they're radiated, so they're already, like, their skin's already screwed up. So if you burn them, it should hurt more. Because they already have, like, radiation burns. And then they have real burns on top of the fire. Oh, crap. Okay. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? Go. What the fuck? Okay, screw it. Senior shotgun time. Well shooting her seemed to fix whatever fucking jumping AI issue she had there. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Shotguns are fucking OP. And I love it. Mm -hmm. Another little hidden cash here. Okay, okay, I'll take I'll take lead. Guess we'll just harvest these things real quick and uh, be on our way. We should only have one more level to clear and then we'll be done and 
we'll head back to base for the night and get everything sorted and probably just mine some stone so we're gonna need lots and lots of stone here soon not only for our renovations and expansions but also to sell oh shit oh shit okay thought you were dead wasn't <laughs> boom Let's see. Just gonna sell all that shit. Okay. Oh my god, I know it's just a tier two, but worthless dog shit loot. Um, alright. We'll go ahead and take him out and then get the hell out of here. I actually uh, almost left before we completed the quest, so that was cool. However, they are uh, starting to get really riled up out there, so we're going to go ahead and loot these couple things, then go back upstairs and plan our escape. Alright, so they are kind of working their way in through that main lobby. I think for now we're just going to jump down and... Yeah, I don't like the sound of what's going on in there, so we're going to jump down and get the hell out of here. Oh, and they actually have busted through a lot of that wall, so it's a good thing we did. But we are safe now, free, out of the city. Zombies left in the dust, and we're going to head back home. Alright, we're back home. Just spent the night kind of organizing everything, getting it all set up and whatnot, and kind of getting everything mapped out we're gonna go ahead and get every electrical component kind of reorganized here yep that's what I'm afraid of even though this is on doesn't really output any power unless you have the stupid cells and let's see if we can hook this up and a generator up you cannot okay well, we will need to figure that out eventually. But right now we don't have any cells, so we don't really need to worry about it. Can we make them? We cannot. So unfortunately, we will have to wait and see if any of the vendors have some. go from steel to crafting books it's not a not a good feeling <laughs> of course not so he sells the bank but not the cells of course uh, of course 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 I mean why would why wouldn't he do we do have that auto shotgun though we're gonna need to get some stone done asapolis probably overnight tonight get that sold and uh, some sugar butts and get that bought for now let's go ahead and go to Jen see if she maybe has some cells and if she doesn't we'll go to Bob and then head back home hopefully one of them will because I'm getting really tired of having to fill up my light generator got a lot of lights on and they really suck up the gas it's kind of annoying but if I don't have them on, it looks kind of stupid. And if I have the torches, you know, the heat signature goes up. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. That is uh, majorly disappointing. Yeah, I guess we'll get the electrical trial. Well, no, I guess not. We need to save up money for the auto shotgun. Well, on our way to Bob's. All right, Bob, what do you got? What do you got for me? What do you got for me? I mean, just a bunch of fucking garbage. Just garbage. It's all garbage. 
non-stop goddamn garbage. God damn. I mean, I guess he's got forged ahead, so it's not a complete waste coming down here. And even though we do have that auto shotgun that we're going to need to get, these are mm, never encumbered at night. God damn, that is a good book. We need to get that. Mm, the rest of that shit he can keep. Yeah, blah. We'll go ahead and read that, and then read our Forged Ahead books. And now it's time to go home. Went ahead and showed back up home, and Mr. Home Run over here bashed his head in when it made him go flying. Freaking showed up trying to start shit. But it's okay, we, uh, you know, he started shit, we ended shit. That's just how it goes. But I think we're going to go ahead and call the video here. You know, it's been a nice glimpse, nice start to the season two. We appreciate you uh, tuning in. I uh, do apologize about my voice. I unfortunately do have still a little bit of a cold, but wanted to get these videos started, get them out there for Halloween for you guys. Hope you have a happy, safe Halloween. Uh, hope to see you next time, and thanks for tuning in. Have a good night.